everyone welcome to figure fantasy so today we'll be featuring all of the unlock content my current figures that i have that i've collected so far um tomorrow please watch out for the beginner's guide that i'll be putting out because right now i'm actually playing the game um and i'm really enjoying it and i'm actually excited let me just show you something Okay, so just want to share this with you guys. So I'm actually a um, a geek in terms of uh, figures. So this is what what I was playing before. And I'm actually happy that it's in digital right now. There's a digital game version of um, this tabletop game that I used to play. And I'll put him here. It's called The Stronghold, by the way. And... I'm really geeking out on the content, uh, on the concept of this game. Um, but again, I've been playing a lot today. So second day again. Um, we're going to start with the content, guys. So we have here Brawl Club. This is basically your PvP. I haven't really, I haven't really progressed far because in terms of team construction, I still am... Uh, um, uh, what they call this i'm still uh constructing the best pvp team for me as of now based on what i have so this is just simple pvp nightmare this is a good stage as well um very good rewards here especially for this one uh the blinds and this one to your to to level up the stamps this is used to level up your skills so again this is a very good stage to progress as well Next is going to be your board game Odyssey, which I was actually able to finish today. Um, I can't feature what, but it's like a, it's like um, going through a map that you can, um, uh, what they call this, you can uh, conquer different stages, get different buffs. Um, I'm sorry, I was able to close this already, the, the level 40 to 50, because I finished it. Um, tomorrow, this is going to be uh, be open. And again, take note, there are a lot of good rewards here. And this one is for your store, which also um, you know can give you additional additional items or additional heroes, um, especially for the blinds we need. So again, very good content to play. Um, I want to elaborate on this more. I'll create a separate video for this. And also, we have the final battle, which is actually pretty sweet. So I haven't reached this, the 6-6, so the other Az Azazel. So, so far I've have I've had this. Uh for tier is I'm at two. And for code V, I'm at two as well. So these give you very, very good rewards as well. Again, I'm very impressed with how the content is very competitive and is kind of very interesting. So what else? save tour as well these are battles which you have to three star to get um, the gems here or the diamond so i'm at two already um this is actually easy to clear as long as you this is more on placement so the objective of of uh, this one is to be able to clear this certain objectives by placement of a certain hero like for example this one you can only place one hero but the crucial part is actually where to place them so that you could achieve these um, these um, objectives. So that's it. So, so far, those are the content they have unlocked. I'm not sure if there are other content that we will be able to see as we unlock, you know, uh, stages further. So, so far, um, I'm actually happy with this game. Um, very happy with how it's very enjoyable. It actually actually um uh invites the real tabletop gamers to this game uh, because again of the appeal of the actual tabletop game and now we have a tabletop game in digital somehow 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 it's a more of a gotcha and of an idol game so here um community so you have your club then friends unlocked collector's list so we already have a a collector's list here with a lot of you know a lot of freebies i've unlocked already so again uh as you clear certain stages then this is for nightmare then a lot of there are a lot of diamonds in this game given for free so 
don't worry guys if you you know if you run out of currency in terms of summoning i i i think you could you know farm a lot of currency for this game um in terms of your blind box um i suggest that you pull for characters or for certain figures um once you have uh diamond especially if we are in the beginning because again the 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 drop rate is not that bad it's actually good so your ultra is at four percent which is kind of very good i like this game and there are a lot of ways to get ultras your blinds especially so i've gotten a um, couple of ultras in my blinds and for the otaku zone i haven't really designed the otaku zone yet this is just this is just very very simple and for the for the otaku zone um as you move forward the other basically the game requires you to level up your first five heroes i'll show you that first uh zarola rico vazorwe <laughs> very hard name to pronounce suzumi and you have a zephyr so these are the four the five most um figures that you need to level up once um you place the other heroes on the top of the otaku then they also gain the level of the lowest lowest of the level so uh, but to, uh, every every everybody here is at level 51 so let's say for example i level up uh, zarola here so just want to upgrade her to 52 as you can see everybody's still at 51 because the lowest of the five is at 51 so that's actually what i'm trying to say so again it's not it's not really difficult to upgrade um the levels because again as you upgrade the five then the rest will follow so for the for the shelves i have i have limited um space right now so i can only put a maximum of five unless i open the otaku level so this oh so photo shoot go to photo shoot this is a this is a new feature <laughs> not sure what this is but i'm gonna take a look at it um after this so basically this is my otaku um i haven't really organized it yet so been you know going through the content so that i can give you guys more information and lastly guys I want to share with you my lineup so so far um these are my mains uh, that i carry so you have again Z uh, zarola rico i'd like a better vanguard for her probably uh, sorry not uh, not vanguard uh but defender i'm looking at megan for defender hopefully i could get her um to replace uh but she's actually good in 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 pve so no surprise and this team is actually based is is really uh, built for pve clearing to the first five that is why i haven't really built my pvp team but again i have decent uh, heroes here for 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 pvp but this is actually my pvp team i'm uh, a pve team so you have rico you have vazer wind uh for more uh, uh range and uh aoe damage you have suzumi and my healer is Zephyr, which I was actually really, really, um, uh, really, really lucky because I got her from the blinds. So, so these are the rest. So I have here um, Sakura. Sakura, she's she's good for PvP. Uh, Usu Usuki is good for PvE. Then you have Zhao Yun. Um, I haven't tested him yet, but but he's good. He's he's in the tier list. And I have here Ophelia. Um, haven't tested her yet. I'm going to try Re because I think her kit is actually good for PvP. So I'm really building my PvP team now. Um, that is where my account is going towards. And here's the rest of the stuff that I have. Just gonna get rid of them. And uh, there you go. So that is it, guys. So those are my update tomorrow again i'll be putting out a beginner's guide a more in-depth beginner's guide i'm just really you know getting the feel of the game as of the moment uh getting my feet wet uh, with all of the figures the content how to farm this how to farm that so this is just a small update to you guys on my progression as well 
and hope you guys like this video and uh, see you guys tomorrow so for those who you who stuck this far please consider subscribing to the channel because moving forward i'll be creating a lot of content for this game and i hope you don't miss that don't forget to click that bell icon and also put a like to this video thank you guys stay safe take care this is the warden and i'm out of here